Today, we will be assembling the 7200H Pinnacle Chair. It will come in three boxes. You'll get the box with the base, the footrest will already be attached, then the second box will have the arm panels and the backrest. So first, what we're going to go ahead and do is assemble the armrest. So you want to get all the bolts that come with the chair. For the Pinnacle, it will have one arm bolt per chair. So on this side, what you want to do is go ahead and connect the corresponding plugs. They can only fit in one way. Okay, and then the air hose will clip in as well, like that. And you want to make sure it clips. Clip and clip, there you go. And then these metal bars, hooks, want to connect over this bar. You'll go on an angle, like that, drop it in. Okay, the back has, right here, if you note, know, there's going to be a, if you see right here, can you see that? The plug, you want to make sure that plug goes in that hole, and you'll feel it clip in. It might take a few turns, but there you go, and that's in. Once you get that bolt pin in the hole, you want to go ahead and go to the front of the chair. Right here, you'll need to unzip this zipper. The zipper does not have a head. I would recommend using a zip tie if there's one already inside there, or a bread tie or a paper clip. Mm -hmm. So once you have that removed, go ahead and get it out of the way. Zip it up the side. And right inside here, you will see where the bolt goes in. You might have to move this forward and back to get the bolt to line up. Let's try. So if you see right here, where the bolt goes in, it slides into the groove as well, so like that. There you go, and that's tight. Okay, so that's the only bolt for that, and now we'll go ahead and do the other side as well, and it's the same as that side. Put it down close, connect both corresponding plugs. Okay. Okay, and okay. Okay, bottom one's in. Okay, once those are in, you want to fit them down gently and line up all your other pinholes. Okay, like that. There you go. And that's it. Get the other bolt material. Then we'll get this front bolt in as well. So once you have that done, you go ahead and put your seat cover down. You want to go ahead and connect this again. And our zippers do not come with the heads because we don't want the zipper heads to put a hole in the leather. So if your chair is missing zipper heads, it's not because it's missing them, it's because we built it that way. Okay, there you go. So now the next step is going to be the backrest. You want to go ahead and just lay your cushion over the front so you can get to the back area of the chair. The backrest is going to slide into these brackets right here and here. In order to hook up the motor for the backrest, you need to pull out the assembly. What you need to do is grab right here and try to pull it out. And that's what you need to swing out. You see there's an air hose, air hose, electrical, and main communication cables. The easiest way for me to do this is to lay the chair like this, pick it up underneath the armor's arm shoulder pads, and put it in both sides at the same time. That is it. So when it's in, push the chair forward like this. So what you want to do is take that, that thing that came down, find this motor right here. You're going to align it up with the motor. You can turn it, twist it to get it to come in or out. One way turns it in, one way turns it out to kind of match it up with this. Yeah. Want to get the pin. Oh. And line up the pin to the motor. Like so. Like that. And then stick your cotter pin through the hole. Like so. Okay, that's in. So then here's the yellow cable or air hose. So just reach your hand under here and connect. Push them all the way in. That's one. And two's over here, just follow. Like I said, they're all color coded. These come out. There's that plug. I just found it right there. And right there, you gotta reach up in there and plug it in without seeing it. Okay, next plugged in. And now you wanna take these big black and grays. Black goes to black. And you wanna make sure they clip in very well. Clip, clip in, clip in. Okay? Now you plug in the power, pull your back wrist back, you'll hear it clip. Once you do that, you want to go ahead and take your back pad. And again, it has a zipper head on this one, which is a zipper to the top here. Okay, and then you zipper it up. You want to go ahead and take this red air hose, put it through the top of here. Get your pillow that came with the chair. Hook that up as well. And then this was a zip tie here. And that is now an assembled chair. 
You'll have your remote. Remote holder will clip in here. I don't have one for this chair, but it will clip in. And your remote will slide in as well. Okay, that is the assembly of a Pinnacle 7200H massage chair. Thank you, guys.